you have your amber glass, your green glass, and your clear glass. As you can see, the glass gets smaller The use of recycled glass as an aggregate in Portland cement went under the microscope in this laboratory. These students at Pennsylvania State University investigated how cement containing glass in the form of powder can be more durable and significantly more environmentally friendly. Farshad Rahabipur was the team leader investigating the mechanism of alkali silica reaction in these aggregates. Rahabipur says that the new echo cement exhibited an unusual size effect in which the reactivity of glass continuously lessens by reducing its particle size dramatically. I think what, what makes this project very unique is that uh, the glass is produced almost everywhere and everywhere we need concrete. So as a result, we can put the glass in concrete and make it more, and make it more sustainable. The process started here, explains Jared Wright. With the consumer buying the glass and then they deposit it and instead of recycling it in a landfill, we crush it and use it as a sand replacement in concrete. The bottles that you have over here is what we're taking is soda lime bottles such as your standard bottles that you see here. They don't necessarily have to be alcoholic bottles, but they're just the bottles that we have. We want to take these bottles here and we want to crush them to a smaller size here in order to wash them and then dry them in order to get the impurities off of them. As we get further down the line, as you can see, the glass gets smaller and smaller and that we want to use it as a fine aggregate replacement for the sand. Glass is the least recycled material in municipal solid waste streams and can be a green aggregate in a new echo cement, states Chris Wright, another student participating in the research. Basically what we do is we mix the glass powder in with the water and the fine aggregate as sand or more glass or coarse aggregate and we mix these up and proportion them as necessary and then once they are cured we test them for their strength and porosity and other tests that are significant. By its nature, the production of Portland cement, a limestone-based binder, significantly depletes natural resources and stresses the environment. So Portland cement itself is not very environmental or economical friendly. Cement production accounts for 6% of all carbon dioxide emissions on the planet. Replacing the aggregates with powdered glass promotes sustainability by limiting pollution, reducing energy consumption, and preserving resources. This also saves money by utilizing a far less costly leftover industrial byproduct. This is your basic ASTM 1260 test, which tests the expansion of your aggregate um, in, a, in a mortar system, a mortar mix that did not use any cement replacement. So this is just using gl uh, glass as a fine aggregate replacement, not as a cement replacement. The objective of this research was to utilize glass, a waste material, as a replacement of eco-negative Portland cement in high performance and environmentally efficient concrete materials. If we can reduce the amount of cement in our concrete con construction and give the same concrete with the same quality, so that would be one step towards uh, a more uh, a greener uh, concrete construction. The green component is not shipping your, your glass waste to landfills as well as not producing as much carbon by creating cement. Currently, every year in the United States, more than 600,000 tons of recycled glass bottles are stockpiled due to prohibitive shipping costs from recycling locations to glass melting factories. It is doable and that's what part of our research is. What we want to do is we want to see both the reactivity as well as its compressive strength and see if it is comparable to that of concrete that we already have. And by doing this we are reducing significantly the emissions of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere, which is the statement of going green. Based on this research, green concrete can be used in various transportation related applications, such as highway barriers, pavements and buildings, just to name a few of the possibilities, Wright pointed out. Uh. The environmental impact of Portland cement concrete production has motivated researchers and the construction industry to evaluate alternative technologies by incorporating recycled cementing materials and recycled aggregates. And we work well together. Sandvich, you gotta get it clicked a certain way?